What's up guys, we're back with another video and today we're going to be making homemade bird feeders for um, our family and friends. And hashtag homemade Christmas. So today is day five and we have a fun project. I have Luke, my buddy here. He's, how old are you Luke? Ten. <laughs> you're ten and then you're in fourth grade? Yeah. Yep. Getting big on me. Mm -hmm. So he's my littlest. And today we are going to be making bird feeders. This guy loves him some nature. So here we're gonna take care of the birds. We got some boiling water. It's really boiling. It is really boiling. And we're gonna put some gelatin in there and Why do you get... need to do boiling water to put gelatin in? Gelatin. That's a good question. I don't know. We just follow directions around here. So we're just thankful for whoever comes up with the ideas that we can just follow the directions. So we have ourselves half a cup of boiling water, which is not very much, and I was kind of worried about the steam evaporating it. All right, Luke. So you want me to put, put this in, yep, in the you, boiling water in here? Yep. Put a pack of gelatin. Go ahead and pour it all in there. Okay. And then the other all the way in fast. Yep. Now I'll do the other one. Excellent job. Now we want to take our whisk. This is called a whisk. Can I do it? You just put the trash over there. Yep. Can I do it? Yep. And okay. you're going to whisk it around. Yep. Good job until it's all stirred in. I'm, I'm keeping it here over here so then it doesn't get hot. Good job. Can you see in there or do you need to scoot up some? It's jiggly. I have a little block here. All right. So we can look down in there. It's kind of foaming. Get all around the sides. You do an excellent job. Thank you. Is I'm it all? Do you think I'm it's a master all? chef. <laughs> master chef. Do you think it's all combined now? Yeah, maybe. All right. The next step is to pour in one and a half cups of bird seed. So, Luke. In there. Yep. In there. In here. Yeah. Uh, do I need to take the whisk out? Here, I'll hold the whisk. Okay. Oh. Uh, you all kind of got stuck to the whisk. Alright, pour that in. All of it? All of it. Good job. Excellent. I'm not eating that for breakfast. <laughs> oh no, you're not going to eat that. Alright, so now you're going to stir this. Whisk it all together. Whisk. It's sticky. Probably so. It's not steaming anymore. Nope. Make sure it gets all good and coated. That did all in the walls. Do I need to get the Yep, around through? the walls. Do you think the birds like the jello? What do you think? Yeah. Yep. It's unflavored gelatin, so it's like jello but without any flavor. It's like it's so they can still smell their yellow like, bird seed. It's like diet bird seed. <laughs> Diet bird seed. Do you think diet food doesn't have any flavor? No. Is that what I'm hearing you say? Yeah, there's no flavor in diet food. No. I don't think so. Everyone, once in a while, when mom's on a diet, he's like, why are you eating that? So the, when mom's stirring up uh, the stuff for the, the gelatin. Yeah, the gelatin and the bird seed. Mm -hmm. My little girl's here. That's why we're humans. All right, so we're going to take it off the heat and let it cool down just a little bit enough that we can handle it. And then... Look, Mom. <laughs> that's a really good picture of the bird seed. I see that. Mm -hmm. Yep, there's <laughs> a sunflower seed. We're going to grow sunflowers next year in our mm. flower meadow. You like it? I do Every like single it. little piece. So now we're going to... Do you want to put it in one? Mm -hmm. Choose wine design first to fill it all the way. It has to be completely full. There you go. So while it's still hot, you can use the spoon. Yep, and just put a generous amount in each one and then we'll flatten. Oh, what's a generous amount? Generous, what do you think generous means? Good. A lot, yep. Overflowing, right? Mm -hmm. Like if you were going to be generous with whatever you give someone, you give them a whole bunch. You don't like, be. Like Jesus? Mm hmm. The opposite would be stingy. What do you think stingy would be? Uh, not a lot. Yeah, you hold some back for yourself. You only give them a little tiny bit to make you... Is that good again? Yep. Get a little more. I need some of the... Yeah, we want it has to be completely all the way.
joyful. There you go. So which one did you choose to do first? The bird one. The bird mold? Mm-hmm. Okay. You have to the next one. Okay, the dog. Are you going to do the dog next? Who can give the dog to you? Aunt Mary? Yep, she likes birds. And dogs. And dogs. Aunt Mary likes dogs. Um uh what do, what do what do you guys do um when it's Christmas? Luke wants to know what you do for Christmas. What is your traditions? Do you think they make bird seed ornaments? Uh, I don't know. They gotta, gotta leave it in the comments. Oh, yes. Luke likes to read the comments. Yeah. That's one of his favorite things about having a YouTube channel. Also for the subscribers. I like you. I like, I love you subscribers. You love the subscribers? Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're cool. They are cool. They are cool. really cool. It is pretty cool to have people come and join us in our activities, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to put this in here. All right, so now we have all the molds filled, and Luke's going to take these little straws that we cut up, and you're going to put them in where you think they would hang, okay? So not so close at the top. You have to be kind of in the middle of it. Yep. And push it all the way down to it's touching the bottom of the tray. I don't know if that's how Yeah, oh, don't lift it up. But I want to know if time. it's... Uh, I'll, I'll double check it for you. Yeah, I think that's good. All right, keep doing that to all the ones that we have left. You can already tell they're getting very sticky and um, hard because they're sticking to the molds of the cookie cutters. So this should definitely turn into a really hard uh, ornament. But the next ornament. step... It's well, a it's a bird feeder. Or it could be an ornament, like an outdoor ornament on the tree yeah. that the birds like to eat. Yeah. Yeah. So the next step will be to refrigerate for two hours. And then after two hours, we can pop them out of the molds and then lay on the counter and to... Take off the sh and take off the things. Mm -hmm. Yep, we'll take off the molds and then we'll just lay them on the counter we'll to dry the, overnight. The, um, straws. Yeah, the straws will come out and that's where the string will go through. And then after that they'll be ready for the outdoors. So um, tomorrow morning, we should be able to put them outside. Does that sound fun? Mm -hmm. And then the birds can enjoy them. We have tons of birds around here and they love their bird feeders. Luke and dad, don't you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He just sits sometimes with his drawing book and draws the birds that are at the bird feeder. And then um, he also likes to get, we have a little, a book of birds of Oklahoma. Uh, wild birds of Oklahoma, and you like to do that. And sometimes you take your binoculars to the window, uh, don't you? I have it right like, I don't know where my book is. You don't know where your book is right now? Yeah. I think it's in the garage, but or sometimes we like to, or the shop, yeah. Sometimes we like to do that. All right, are they ready for yeah. the refrigerator? Yep, yeah. let's go put them in. Okay. Yep, you can put it back in. Does it fit? You might have to go a long ways. Good job. They look That's great. All right, they look great, Luke. I can't wait to see them. Let's set the timer for two hours. Two hours. Well, guys, thanks for following along on day five of hashtag homemade Christmas as we made bird seed gifts today uh, with my buddy Luke. <laughs> anyway, we just hope you have a great day and we will see you tomorrow. Until then, go do something you love with oh, the people the, that you by love. By the way. Um, if you got any prayer requests, we'll pray for you. To, um, so do it in the comments down below. Um, tell us any prayer requests, requests so we can pray for you. Yes, we would love to pray for you. So leave a uh, request down below, and Luke and I will do that together. Okay. Bye. See y'all tomorrow.